Alice, thanks for the call. What would you like to say about this story? What I'd like to say is I'm disgusted with the English public that they want to invade a young woman's privacy. I think they've been absolutely disgusting. And I thought it was heartbreaking that she had to come out and speak when she's in that terrible condition to keep people quiet. I think the whole country should hang their heads in shame. Do you think she was forced to come out and do that video yesterday? No, I think she probably wanted to do it because she knew she had to do something. But it's a shameful state of affairs that a young woman that's suffering had to do that. I think it's disgusting. I, th I think a lot of people will feel the same way, Janice. What lessons do you think we can learn from this the next time something like this happens? A figure in the public eye saying, do you know, something's up. I'm not going to tell you what it is. Give me a bit of privacy. Well, to be honest, I don't think we can ever do it because the country's gone into such a stupid condition now. And also, even if they know what's wrong with her, what can they do? They can't mm. help her. Well, and, and, and I'm sure the added stress of all the speculation hasn't helped her condition whatsoever. I'm not a medical expert, but it can't, it can't be a nice oh, thing. I think it's stretch, but I think, as I say, I think the country should hang its head in shame. OK. Janice? I mean, we've got the king and we've got her. Prince William, I don't know how he puts one foot in front of the other. It must be awful for him with his father and his wife dealing with all of this. And he's got three little children. Yeah. Honestly, I'm shocked. And also, I'm speaking from experience because I've got cancer. I couldn't go out and speak now. Are you are you are you getting treatment for it, Janice? I'm just I'm just in the middle of treatment. Yes. Well, I wish you really really well with that, Janice. Thank and you. I, I hope... And that's why I felt for her so much yeah. because I thought if I had to get made up and go in front of a camera now, that would not be possible. How do you talk to your to your friends and neighbours about it? Do you keep it pretty low key, pretty quiet, or or do you I feel people? In fact, last week a friend of mine came round and tried to discuss it. I said I won't talk about the royal family. Yeah, 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 yeah. But but I mean your own, your own cancer. How do you? How do oh, you... I, I've just I've taken it. I've taken it. I'm 80 years old. I'm lucky to have got to this age. I've not, it... I've not made a fuss about it, to be honest. Yeah. Well, Janice, we wish you really, really well. Keep in touch, and thanks for the call. Really appreciate that.